Cheers, mate. Got you. What time is the first instalment going to hit my bank account? You, uh, you should have it this morning. Definitely freed up the funds, yeah? Yeah, 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 of course I have. Like I said, not a problem. Good. Look, so if you're flush, can you start paying my allowance again? Look, I can't pay your allowance. I've had to borrow the money to repay Max. <laughs> of who? It's not important. Is that how you run your business empire? Borrowing from one person to pay another? When are you going to stop being so stupid and grow up? Me grow up? At least I'm not the one leeching off my dad. <laughs> Dad's going to be OK, isn't he? What do you mean? Well, I heard what you told Nan. If, if he just keeps borrowing more money, is he just going to end up in a bigger hole? You know, Dad. He always lands on his feet. Yeah, OK. Well, I'll see you later. Why would Gran offer to remortgage the cafe? I'm sure he has. What are you talking about? Drop the pretense. I found a letter from the bank. First you rip off Max, and then you rip off your own mother. Why do you automatically think this is to do with me? I mean, why do you always think the worst of me? Peter, you... Your Gran didn't want you to know, OK? But the truth is... She's having cash flow problems. I mean, the CAF being closed for all those months, so she took out a mortgage on the place. Then why did she offer to remortgage it today? Well, that was for the whole thing. I mean, there's still lots of collateral in that place. You really expect me to believe that? So you'd rather believe that I was stealing from my own mum? I mean, do you think that little of me? OK. I'll go ask Grant. No, no, Peter, don't do that. She told me in confidence she's a proud woman. I mean, what, why are you always trying to cause trouble? I mean, that was me thinking of reinstating your allowance, but why should I support a son who doesn't support me? No, I, I do support you. Thanks, Dad.